What is going on? Early morning, I've got a day off today, uh, but that's not what I'm thinking about right now. Um, judging by the title of the video, I'm not sure what I'm going to title it, but at this very moment, guys, at this very moment in time, I am either about to start my day off on an absolute high or get rejected live on camera and um, have to get over it. So, <clears throat> a little bit of a backstory. You guys, you guys know, man, I don't have a girlfriend. I'm single. That's the reason why there's no girls in my video. There's no sort of family vibe. It's just me because it is just me. I'm fucking, I'm single. I've been single for like four years. I think half the reason is because I'm in Alice Springs. There's not a lot of choice. <laughs> um, but at the end of the day, there is one girl here that I've seen and thought, fuck, she'd be one that I'd actually, you know, drop, drop everything for and, and try it out. I don't know if a relationship, fuck, I don't fucking know. At the end of the day, there's one girl here that I'm really interested in, and I have been for ages. So, what would you do, guys? What would you do? How would you approach it? How would you approach it? I've fucking, I've met up with her once out in town. I don't go out drinking. It's, fuck it, it's extremely hard for me to meet up with someone out, like, on a Saturday night or something, because I don't, I fucking don't do it. Um, and, you know, trying to get to know someone over text message is just fucked up. So I've been trying and trying to set up something for like the last six months. Every now and then, every couple of months, I'll say something, I'll drop a hint. It won't, you know, it falls on deaf ears. It won't fucking come to anything. And at the end of the day, <laughs> last night, it just got too much. I was like, no, fuck this. Fuck this. I'm tired of just sitting here saying absolutely nothing um, when she might be, you know, getting hit up by other cunts. And I was like, fuck this, I'm not going to lose my opportunity if it's there. So, <laughs> I sent her a message last night, finally saying, I won't say, I won't tell you what I said, but basically I said I fancied her, um, I'd love to meet up, and I thought she was sexy as hell. <laughs> so, I got a message back this morning, at about quarter past six, and I didn't want to read it because, like, fuck man, I'm, I'm nervous, I'm fucking nervous as hell to actually read this reply, so what I'm going to do is actually read it on camera, so that whatever, whatever is said, um, I think I'm going to get over it pretty easy to be honest, fuck, if she tells me fuck off, I mean what, <laughs> at least I know now, honestly like the main thing I was getting fucked off at is, is not knowing man, I was like fuck this man, I gotta, I gotta say something, I gotta say something, I gotta tell this chick how I'm feeling, because, you know, if you're thinking about someone, you gotta tell them, or else it just eats you alive. So, anyways, fuck that. I'm gonna see the reply. <sighs> Here goes nothing, man. Well, fucking, there you go. Is that just an excuse? Ha ha, oh, that's very sweet for you to say. Thank you. But I guess I'm hesitant to see you because I have a boyfriend. I'm sorry. Is she just fucking saying she has a boyfriend? Like, you never even know with girls, do you? Honestly, you don't even know. Boyfriend. The fuck, Well, that was a massive, well, that was a fucking huge, well, that was a huge build-up for absolutely nothing. What the fuck do I say? What do I say back? I'm not, like, I'm not going to fucking message her again, obviously. I just want to say something to, like, leave an impression. <laughs> I think I'm going to say, I don't fucking know what I'm going to say. God damn. I don't really give a shit. Fuck this. I'm going to the post office, man. I've got fucking packages to get. Hopefully they're there now. I've been waiting for packages for the last week. Two weeks, actually, for some of them. Really hoping some of them are there. So I'm going to make a coffee, and I'll see you back in here in a minute. And we'll go to the post office to see what's there. All right. We are back. <laughs> We're back in action. I've got over my depression. It's all good. <laughs> oh, my God. How shit is that? How fucking gay is that, eh? <sighs> what do you do? I don't really... I wrote back, I wrote back, I said, what a waste. With a kiss face. 
So fuck you, boyfriend. Fuck you. <laughs> Feels. I got some real cool shit coming to my post office box over the next week. So let's hope something is there. I went crazy on eBay and I went fucking ham on, on massivejoes.com on supplements. So fucking let's, let's hope something's there. I'm really hoping for something. Finally. All right. Yes, there was a card in my mailbox, but no, it wasn't for me. It was for my flatmate, which always happens, man. She's killing me. She's fucking killing me. Every package I think's for me is always for her. So anyways, I uh, picked that up for her. I'm taking it home now. I've got some contact lenses. The reason I've been wearing my glasses so much lately is because I ran out. They're a cost that you gotta keep paying if you want the privilege of wearing contact lenses. So I do, especially today. I'm fucking over wearing glasses at the moment. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna go home now and I'm gonna drown my sorrows in a pre-workout meal and then I'm gonna go and train some legs so there's only one way to get yourself back up from being a bit down and that is to go and smash a fucking epic workout get a sweat up get a pump going you feel much better for it so today's gonna to be legs and there's definitely a couple of machines there that I'm really enjoying at the moment especially one of the, the um, hack squats that they've got. It's like a pendulum squat, it's fucking nice. It's actually really great, especially for my structure. So definitely be showing you that and uh, anything else that happens. So I'll see you there. You guys you guys reckon your Gold Coast weather is, uh, is good, man? Have a look at this. Every single motherfucking day is the same. Bright blue sky, no clouds. I love it. Alright guys, post-workout. Leg session was really good actually. It was fucking, it was great. The intensity was there, the pump was there. Um, it was three exercises. I did five working sets on the first, I did six working sets on the second, and I did probably about four or five working sets on the third. So, you know, 15, 16 working sets, as well as warm-up sets. Um, I did a bit of foam rolling at the end, so it was a great workout. It was about two hours in total. And right now, I'm actually sitting outside Domino's. <laughs> I'm going to get some pizza. Um, I've got calories to fill. I've got kangaroo meat at home that I can actually put on top even though I won't need that because I've just bought two extra meat, meat lovers pizzas and I can't fucking wait to dig into them man, I'm so hungry and I haven't had pizza in a long time. So, um, the workout guys was was uh, really good, like I said, three, three exercises, I did take some footage so I'm about to put that uh, on the screen now and do a little voiceover. So the first exercise guys was a machine that I haven't actually used before. It's a, I don't know if it's called a pendulum squat or a, a hack squat, it's obviously some sort of hack squat, but anyways, you get underneath it and I don't know what it is about this machine, but I think it, it just suits, it suits the mechanics of my body. Um, you know, like you'll see, I, I can go right down, I can squat right, right down and, and, you know, go back up, keeping the tension on my, on my quads the entire time, which is the amazing thing. Um, so I can choose whether to go right down and bounce it slightly off the bottom or I can stop just before the bottom um, you know I can really play around play around with the tempo um, it's a fantastic movement for my body as per usual I pyramided up the weight to my working set weight my first set my first warm-up set was with 20 kilos on each side I think I did a, an easy set of uh, 12 or so um, you know in between these sets I'm doing 
what you'd probably call you know static stretches I'm doing dynamic warm-ups I'm doing you know hip swings things like that leg swings um, just to get my joints warmed up there's nothing worse than going into heavy squats um, on knees that aren't lubricated uh, it's just not good so with that said I worked my way up um, second set was with two plates aside and the third set which was my first working set after all of that warm-up work was with three plates aside and it was a good a really good set of 10 reps um, and I stuck to that I did five sets of 10 reps and I'll tell you what like after the third set usually honestly after the third set I'd be like fuck I'm, I'm getting pretty fatigued I, I might drop the weight but I was I was determined to stay at that weight for 10 sets no for, sorry for five sets of 10 reps and that's exactly what we did so you know when it comes to to leg workouts when it comes to back workouts any workout at the moment I'm usually starting with a compound lift and the way I'm structuring my rep and you know set scheme as far as those compound lifts is I'm either going for like a 5x5 five five or a 10x10 10 10. and I'm trying to work my numbers up over time using that sort of structure so today was obviously it wasn't 10x10 10 10. I was definitely not going to do that because I was using you know pretty heavy weight uh, so it was 5 by 10 today, but what that means is that I've, got, I've now got a number that I can use in the future. Next time I go in there, I might try and get 5 by 12. Um, you know, who knows? Slowly, slowly work my way up. If I start getting 15 reps with three plates, I'll put, I'll, you know, put half a plate on and go with three and a half plates. And, and you know, I might go down to eight reps. Then what will happen is I can work my way up and do it all over again. Progressive overload. So I'm hoping... I'm hoping that is what's going to happen. I've spent so much time, I've, I've spent so much fucking time in the last two years in deficit that that hasn't been happening. So I'm, you know, I'm fucking excited to actually see that happening and to progressively overload, like I was saying. Second exercise, guys, was uh, the leg extension. Leg extension, I have been sticking to sets of 15 to 20. I feel like I don't want to go heavy on the leg extension, you know, even something like 10 to 12 reps is still too heavy. If I'm getting to failure on 12 reps, it means that the weight's fucking heavy. It's putting a lot of pressure on my knees, and I don't like it. So I've been sticking to around about 60, 65, maybe 70 kilo um, on the leg extension if I'm feeling really strong. But either way, guys, it's 15 to 20 reps, usually 20 reps, um, five to six working sets. And by the end of that, my, my, my fucking quads are shaking like hell, you know. The fatigue is there, um, and I've got the most out of the movement. So from there, guys, my, my quads were fucked, but I did want to do another sort of compound lift that would target the whole entire leg. Um, I wasn't up to doing squats, so I went to the leg press, and I haven't actually used this leg press before. It's, it's quite an interesting one because it's unilateral, but um, you've got these pins where you can you know stick the two plates together, two sides, so then you can make it a double leg leg press like I'm using at the moment. So... Um, the, it's actually a really nice movement to be honest it's nicely lubricated it's nice and smooth um, the only thing is actually when you try and get out of it uh, there's no sort of the, the pad and there's bars like everywhere there's fucking metal and you, you've got nowhere to stand when you try and get up so that's kind of weird but as far as a, a movement and um, as far as a movement and allowing me to keep my tempo you know nice and slow uh, it's a great movement. So with that said, guys, that was the end of the workout. Probably around about 15 working sets. Um, you know, a couple of warm-up sets on each exercise. That's what I normally do. I'm not going to go jump into a working set weight without having uh, warmed up. And uh, in the meantime, guys, you can look at the tricep. I'm, I'm weighing like I'm weighing about 95 kilo at the moment, and I've got I've got a tricep. I'm fucking happy about that. I'm in the best con I'm in the best condition I've ever been in at this weight, and I can't complain with that. But with that said, guys, I'm pretty sure my pizza is going to be ready, so I'm going to go and get them, and I'll see you guys at home. We're home now. I think this might be actually. I think. I think I've just found my natural YouTube halo light behind the camera which is actually just a window so if I put my camera right up to the screen like that I can talk to you guys with the the glow of the natural sun coming in the light to make my eyes really blue and make the the circles under my eyes go 
go less and all that good stuff from, from lighting, right? So, with that said, guys, right here we've got two pizzas and um, they're about to go down, as well as your old mate, the monster. And I'm not going to show you guys, I'm just going to fucking crack into it. My mouth is watering right now, I'm so hungry. Um, so with that said, hope you guys enjoyed the video. <laughs> I think I'm going to cut it here. Um, there's not too much else that's going to happen today, I'm just going to chill out, relax, watch TV. I've got a day off work, so that's great. I can just eat at my leisure, and um, I hope you guys have a great day as well. Uh, the, the, uh, the sky is blue, as per usual. I'm sure you guys know that already. Let's have a look at it, but let's have a look at it though. Looks a little white than this camera, I'm not sure. Anyways. It's nice. You guys know. You guys know the drill. Um, this morning was funny, wasn't it? <laughs> Got rejected on camera. Fuck. Oh well. That's all good. We'll move on to the next one. But that one definitely was my favourite. Hmm. What do you do? Nothing can stop me, I'm all the way up. Hey!